You put that paw down, sir. Hey. No. We don't... We don't do that. We don't... We don't tap tap. We don't tap tap. Hey everybody, it's Jeremy. Welcome back to Lunar 2 Eternal Blue. This is episode 20, 24. We're in the icy caves place uh, above the village that I can't remember. Power Crest? What is this? Powers up. Other crests worn. Huh? What? What? Excuse me? Okay, well, what else do we have? We have the Snake Crest. And we have... Uh, the Dream Crest. I guess we'll... Oh, we also have the Shiro Crest. Chris is using range. What if we remove... That one, and we give this to Hero. And we do... I oh, didn't shit for him. He loses five points of wisdom to gain five range. Doesn't... doesn't seem to do anything. Okay. What if we instead take the Snake Crest, Poison Magic... Oh, oh, oh! Okay, it's in yellow now. I bet it, I bet it, like, levels up the spell. But it does. Wait, what else? Let's see. All right, he's not spinning to winning, so we don't have to go crazy. Um, poison dart plays the same. Badness hero. Okay. Well then, a little uh. Less cool than I thought it was going to be. Oh, we dream dance both of those guys. That would be pretty sweet. Gypsy magic! We did! Cool. Nice. Burning rain kills everything. That was a flawless victory. Hell yeah. Nicely done. I'm not super impressed by the power crest so far. I am uh, ready to be proven wrong, though. Wasn't it Killer Instinct that used to say flawless victory? I thought it was... Is it Killer Instinct that says flawless victory? It's Mortal Kombat, yeah. Supreme victory. Hopefully we put these to sleep. Hell yeah. Of course, Lamina takes it in the face. 
the poison dart something. I'm just gauging what the damage is. Not horrible. Not, like, super fantastic, but not horrible. We'll keep an eye on it, but so far, not impressed by the Power Crest. Odory Babodory. Almost back up to 3k. That would make me feel better if the last item we had bought hadn't been 2.1. Okay. A water staff. That's pretty neat. Expected. But, you know, we're still going to check. Aha! Alright, well, we need to post-sword that guy. Um, and honestly, the rest of these guys I'm not super concerned about, truth be told. I think we can just attack this guy and attack here. Um, we're going to take a hit anyways, unless we a uh, burning rain. That I just don't think is super worthwhile here. Because we're getting pretty low on mana on everyone, except for Ron Bar. So, you know. I'll take care of this. Hell yeah. Um, and now we can just auto attack. Kinda hoping we get a level on Jean and Lamina before we fight whatever boss is here. You're gonna go read more of The Hobbit with your kid. Hopefully, you'll be back before the end of the stream. Enjoy. I hope your I hope your kid's having fun with The Hobbit. That was a um, that was a pretty defining book for me in my childhood. I think it's a really good read or a fun read. I don't know about a good read. <laughs> Depends on your interpretations, I suppose. Um, yeah, we'll attack there. I think it's worthwhile. Bad choices. Bad choices. Why Why did I do this to myself? I just wasn't thinking about how I... How this was going to work out. I was just like, you should save mana. And then... Oof. Mega magic flame! Use the right tool for the job. Like... Else you end up having a leftover guy. Odory Babodory. Did I check that other hole? Uh-oh. I don't know that I checked that other hole. I wonder if she even needs to use a spell if her attack will just kill a yeti on its own. Lady Luck, be kind. Mm 
That won't. Yikes, that fucking hurts too. What I get for trying to be a little... Wow! That's a lot of damage. Dude, tactics three. What? 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 Don't look at me. Don't act like you know what's going on. You don't know what's going on. You're just an Odysseus. Oh, also, new video, who this? I don't think, I'm trying to say this at each in each of the videos. Uh, apparently, the snow effect here uh, tanks my uh, computer's ability to process my uh, camera. So, sorry about that. I'm trying to stay in the snowy areas as little as possible. I did spend some time prior to, uh, at the beginning of the stream, trying to figure out what's going on, but I think it's just, I don't know. I think it's just really weird processing. It'd be what it be. Um. We just bite the bullet on this one. Do you really want to bite the bullet when you're going to be needing to probably flame shot a big... I don't know that I want to bite the bullet, actually. I'm going to try the Destiny Dice to save uh, Anna on Lamina. We're a little banged up. It's a tough area, honestly. Like, very high resource cost um, going through this place. And we cost ourselves even more. Yikes. Should've just attacked. Treasure chest. A barrier ring. What do we got here? Increases both types of defense. Interesting. The 91. Um. Ooh. Actually, kind of do think this would be a better, a little bit better. His, uh, his magic defense is pretty damn low. So is Hero's, but Hero has more health to compensate. I guess so is Jean's. Holy shit, her magic defense is horrible. We swap things around here. Do something like that. We do something like this. Maybe do something like this. Those are kind of inconsequential, I feel like. Alright, cool. I see that hidden treasure chest. Fucking hell. Um... Nothing really doing. We're just burning rain. We're gonna have to take a hit. We burning rain so that we don't have to worry about anything afterwards. That 
That tears me up. Uh, we should be fine to just do attacks. Hey, Jean levels up to 25. Her attack goes up by 2 to 45. Her defense goes up by 2 to 49. Her agility goes up by 2 to 63. Her speed goes up by 2 to 67. Her wisdom goes up by 1 to 63. And her magic defense goes up by 1 to 47. Lamina also levels up to 25. Attack goes up by 2 to 36. Defense goes up by 2 to 43. Speed goes up by 1 to 34. Oh, she's so slow. Uh, Wisdom goes up by 2 to 70. And Magic Defense goes up by 2 to 73. Um, and we are once again approaching that scenario where we are kind of beat to shit. A Phoenix Ring. What? the fuck is that? Is that an auto-revive? Decreases water and wind damage. That actually might be really good on Ronvar going into this particular fight. We'll just put the wind ring over here for now. Also, never know when the next door will lead to a boss, so. I don't think this door leads to a boss, because I think we've seen more enemies on, like, ledges and things, so. Probably up there. Yeah. Um... We are very low on, very low on mana. Yes, again, uh, taking damage does mean that we have to use mana, but uh, typically the mana that we use is less than what we would use for other stuff. Nice. Ooh, paralyzed. I'll take care of this. Is that little, like, puff of breath the I'm gonna, like, uppercut you animation? It might be. Yikes. We go for that instead. Alright, this, I would assume, is the end. Maybe not directly the end, but like, going into the final cavern or something. Uh, yeah, hell yeah it is. Oh. What? What was that? I'm gonna have to get back into voices. Oh god. Um. It sounded like some kind of beast. Mm -hmm. We're downwind from where the sound came from. Plug your noses. I'm predicting stench. Ronfar, this is no time for jokes. That was some kind of beast, and it's close. We need to be on guard. Anything can happen. Avalanche? It's the monster! It's about to attack us! Where is it? Where is it? It's no monster, Red. It's something else. But... 
There we go. Nice. Yikes. Oh god. We're gonna have to go back all the way back through that. Oh god. <laughs> oh. Otis, I'm not gonna be happy. <laughs> Did you come back for us? Hero, hero, wake up! Uh. Hero, please open your eyes for me. What the fuck are you doing on this mountain, lady? L Lucia? Yay, Lucia's back! Oh, hero, you're awake. I can't move. Oh dear. I'll do my best to heal you. And I don't know that you have to heal Ruby. I guess it's okay. I was so worried about you, Hero. I'm so sorry that I left. Lucia, you saved our lives! Yes. Why did you come back to find us? What about your mission? I came back because I... Question mark? When I came to this world from the blue star, finding Althena was my only concern. I did not think or care about anything else. But I feel differently now. Something has changed over the course of our journey. After I left Zulan, and when I was thinking about you, I had the strangest feeling. I never experienced anything like it when I was alone on the Blue Star. It was a throbbing pain in my chest, as if someone had pressed a thorn into my heart. And the further away from Zulan I walked, the greater the pain became. You wonder if I could dis disable the foreground layer, at least while I'm dealing with the snow? But I don't think it's much longer, fortunately. Right, like, I think... I think we're gonna have a boss in this area after this cutscene, and then we're done with Zulan... Probably for the rest of the game, but who knows? I don't really remember. And so I came back to you. I missed you too. You did? Of course I did, Lucia. I was worried about you. And to know that you came back for us means a lot to me. More than you know, probably. Thank you for saving our lives, Lucia. Thank you for coming back into mine. Hero, I... Come on, Lucia. Let's hurry and find the others. Yeah! Alright. Uh... Let's save into the other slot now. And get the fuck out of the snow place! I swear! <laughs> oh, hey! Gene! <laughs> Odis bodis! Who needs Ronfar when you have Lucia? Lucia, what happened? Have you come back to join us? Yes, Jean. I'm sorry that I left. Don't worry about it, Lucia. You came back to us and that's what matters. And I bet Hero is even happier to see you than I am. Admit it, Hero. That face does not go with that statement. All I'll... All I admit is that girls always know how to embarrass me. Yes, we do, Hero. And there's something strangely pleasant about seeing you squirm. That's fair. Anyway, thanks for saving me, Lucia. I owe you my life. You're welcome, Jean. Let's go! Oh, everyone's fully healed by Lucia's m magic healing. Am I... Am I dead? Oh, wait. The hallucination. I can even see Hero and Lucia. How bizarre. How bizarre? How bizarre. I'm so tired. I need to close my eyes again and go to sleep. Don't go to sleep, Ronfar! You'll never wake up again if you do! Now get up! Oh, because that's going to help. Thanks, Ruby. Couldn't you have just turned down the volume? Couldn't you have turned down the volume just a little on that scream, Red? Ruby was trying to save your life, Ronfar. Give her a break. 
Besides, Ronfar, I bet you like it when the girls tell you what to do. You're horny game. And Lamina. Hell yeah. Oh? You idiots! Oh, poof. My dress is soaking wet. Not to mention that I was almost killed in that avalanche. Would have been a tragic loss to the world if I'd perished in these stupid mountains. Wait, how am I still alive? You saved me, didn't you, Lucia? I I don't know what to say. <laughs> would it uh would it be alright if I repaid my life debt to you in monthly installments? The fuck. You don't want any money? You're horrible at business, but you're a great friend, Lucia. Christ. This is where you get to point out a cool feature that is only possible by having Lucia be AI controlled. Ooh, interesting. One of these days, Lamina, you'll realize that some things don't involve money. Uh, when you find out those things, let me know, Ruby. I'm so glad that everyone is alright, but I'm having another strange feeling. The pain which I felt in my heart has changed to warmth. Why has that happened? Her AI script changes several times throughout the game? Really? Oh, yeah, because she becomes more freaking useful. I don't, I don't remember the specifics of it, but I do remember that. It's called a sense of relief. It's the opposite of what you were feeling earlier, which is anxiety. Anxiety. Relief. Yes, of course you're relieved now that your friends are okay. All of you are m my friends. Yay! Okay, here again. Alright. Oh! It is time! End of conversation, I guess? Yep, Dev definitely end of conversation. Th there's the m m monster, so... What do we do now? We stop that hideous thing from dumping any more snow on the village, that's what. And we give it a little payback for trying to bury us under ten tons of snow. Let's do it. Hell yeah. Let's do it, Otis. Oh, it's the missing link! I love that name. I remember this as a... When she starts powering back up after being cursed, she'll, she will start buffing herself. Ooh, interesting. Interesting. Okay, um, so we'll take a look at our options here. I'm assuming fire is going to work really well. She'll start buffing at and starting at this point exactly, she'll start buffing hero. Neat. Oh, right. Yeah, because she's been, she's been throwing the defensive shield on herself previously. But that's kind of it, right? So it will be neat to see her do other shit. Um, I don't know how long this battle is going to be, so we will start installing St. Litany's. B-Dance! Yeah, that was kind of expected. Okay, so it's just Attack City for Jean. And my assumption is going to be... It might be worth doing a single Power Flame on Hero, and then just Fireballs, right? I say that, uh, might be worth doing... I don't know if Po... Okay, well, we can, we can check, right? So, 173... Um... Again, no idea how long this battle will take, so. Yeah, baby, yeah! Yeah, baby, yeah! Fucking. Okay, power flame. Mega magic power! Plus 24 attack power. Interesting. And power charge as well. Uh oh. <laughs> now we're not. <laughs> Plus 20 attack, okay! <laughs> we are not going to be able to see, uh, or really tell. 173, obviously, right? Um, attack. Uh, we'll do one on Jean as well. 
and then and then that's it, right? Like uh, uh, we're attacking or we're we're casting magic from there on. Go sword 173 previous. 269. Holy shit, that was a crazy jump. That's almost an extra hundred damage. Off of. Oh, that's not great. That's, that's intense. That was quite intense. Napalm shot. Aw, shit. Lucia's actually participating. Great. All right, well, we're just going to post sword forever. Uh, we're going to calm Litany to try to keep ourselves alive. We're going to keep attacking. And now it's time to just flame shot, I think. Just time to flame shot. Hmm. It's an increase on Jean's attack as well. Not, not the extra 100 damage, but about an extra 30, I would say. Oh, that's bad. He's... Sometimes faster than Ron Farr, but not always faster than Ron Farr. Okay. That's annoying. Swank. Very swank. We're going to spend the entire rest of this battle trying to recover from that, aren't we? Oh, yeah, yeah. You had to look it up. Ron Farr's Yeah Baby sounds too close to Austin Powers, and the movie did predate the game. So, yeah, I absolutely would assume that that's the case absolutely assume that that's where that came from. Um, revive Litany. I don't know how much it revives at, though. I love this. 65. Uh, definitely in kill range. Yeah, that's annoying. Ronfar is right on the us. Um, an asshole. Despite hard filtered you as a kid. <laughs> it's a, uh, it's, this whole area has been challenging, right? Like, this whole area has been very, very draining of resources. Ooh, is he gonna be shielded from this? Yes, he is. Okay. That's interesting. So when he's breathing in the cold, he's gonna, he's gonna do a. Um, scenario where he we'll try that. I love this. I don't know if this is a power up move or not, though, so he might. He might store up and then unleash on us and just wipe everything, so... So far we've seen his, uh, punch, which has, like, an AoE. Um, we've seen him do the avalanche, and now we've seen him do this, so... Potentially concerning. Um, or, alternatively, it could be a scenario where we have to do enough damage to break it. Um, I'm going to actually move up a little. We're going to do a purity. Not a purity. We're going to do a calm litany. Um, and I'm going to move away slightly. Just in the off chance that this is going to unleash, maybe we'll be able to prevent some of the damage. We must 
It, this might be a uh, hard wipe, though. Like, again, we might have to do enough damage to him to break the, the wind barrier down. Or it might not do anything. Um, okay, back to post sorting. Yeah, we lost our buffs, which is unfortunate. Definitely good to pull him out of the way. I love this. Okay. Mega magic flames. Mega magic flames. to Saint Litany here. This stance means he's in, um, he's gonna do his avalanche, right? Do we want to block that? Like, actually physically block it? Because that's a lot of damage across everyone. Not bad. Pain. Okay, that's gonna be uh nope. Cancel. Can't cancel cancel. Ah! I don't know why I fucking clicked that. Now he's dead. God damn it. Why do I hate myself? Yeah, baby, yeah. I also cast the wrong fucking... No, I didn't cast that spell. He cast that spell. Why would... Oh, God. How do I... Un... How do I cancel? How do I not be like this? Oh. I just had to... I had it all under control again, and I, I decided I wanted to hard mode. For some fucking reason. Okay, we're gonna try to get him back up. Uh, we're just gonna attack here. Uh, we are going to... Uh, recover here. Oh, that's not great. Okay, well he's dead. Fun. Oh, he went for Ronfar instead. That actually works out very well for us. Thank you. Thank you, Missing Link, for being so nice. And I did about everything incorrectly in this fight. Oh, he's uh, about to start sucking in. Um, just attack. Then Saint Litany and just attack. And I would say, because she's not going to make it in time, let's power flame him. We'll do a prep. Power. 
Okay, three people will have that on them. Uh, we're going to move back up here. We're going to hit here. We're going to... I need a Starlight Ronpar. I might need to Starlight Ronpar. I'm going to Starlight Ronpar. And we are going to increase attack power of Gene here. Gypsy power! Yikes! Alright, everyone actually has Purity Litany on them. Not Purity Litany, uh, Saints Litany on them. They have Regen. So. We actually regenerate. Okay. Um, defend. 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 I don't know if flame, if that's, if this stacks. I have no idea if power flame stacks. Do not remember. So, we're gonna go ahead and throw that on and see. Okay, it is time. Toe sword. Um, anger dice. Regular attacks and flame shot. We're gonna do all of the damage. 120. Dodge this. It's like 250. Yeah, nice. Didn't even need that starlight. We had it under control from the very beginning. First time. Easy peasy. That was a little that was a little sketch. <laughs> that got a little a little close. Uh 2,600 experience points. Hero goes up to level 26. Uh, he gains two points of attack for 52 attack. One point in defense to 55. Goes up two points in agility to 50. Goes up two points in speed to 54. That's pretty awesome. Um, and Ruby helped. Yeah, totally helped. Um, up two points in wisdom to 55. And up two points in magic defense to 49. Ronfar levels to 26. Up two points to 57. In attack, uh, up two points in defense. Or up one point in defense to 49. Up one point in agility to 39. Up one point in speed to 46. Up one point in wisdom to 62. Up one point in magic defense to 54, and the coveted up one point in range to 15. Ooh! Light Litany was learned. Steals HP from enemies. Interesting. 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 Very cool. Oh my god! The snow's gone! Is, is my camera back to normal? Is, is the camera back to normal? I'm so excited! Oh, God! You know what? I'm I'm excited enough that that's probably going to be... It's like putting on glasses. God damn it. I don't understand. What? Fucking, fucking technology. Why, why you be like this? All right. You know what? That's as good a place as any for us to go ahead and end this episode. If you're watching on Twitch, stick around. We're going to keep playing. If you're watching on YouTube, I hope you enjoyed. We will see you next time for more Lunar 2 Eternal Blue. Hey, everybody. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider leaving a like, commenting, or subscribing. It really helps me out. If you'd like to see me live, head over to my Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash the distant horizon.